Hi everyone, it's Nikki, aka Damo, and today is March 14th, 2013. <laughs> I know I have trouble with the day sometimes, but um, I know I recently like uploaded a video a few days ago. That was my Weight Watchers weigh-in number two. Um, today's video is actually a makeup review. My eyes look weird. I make up a review on a few products that I really, 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 really like to use. Um, I've tried a few foundations like uh, CoverGirl, L'Oreal, and Neutrogena, and they tend to work well for a short period of time. Well, I wouldn't say well, they because I obviously don't use them anymore, but they worked okay for the time that I use them. Um, now I've kind of gotten a little bit more obsessed about this new product, which I'm talking about today. Um, I have like really oily skin and sometimes like powder foundations don't work well with me and I hate liquid. I just hate putting on liquid foundation. It feels awful. It looks awful. It's, it's just not right for my skin. And then like I already have oily skin and my face looks even more oilier when I put it on so I no longer use those products and I did try the Queen collection for CoverGirl but it's even the Queen collection it, it was kinda hard for me to find a color that like truly matched because I'm not like super dark nor, the, nor am I light skinned and, but I tan in the summer <laughs> so and then I have like patches of skin like on my face like certain parts of my face where um my skin is t a little bit darker like on my cheeks here and here my skin is a little bit darker so I would always have to like buy more than one product that I would have to blend to kind of like cover all the areas of my face so um I'm now using this Maybelline J Matte Mousse let me get down to it it's a Maybelline J Matte Mousse and I'm Caramel Dark Number 2 and this is what it looks like. It looks like this. It's a mousse, but like when you start to apply it, it's not like liquidy or anything. It's not gonna like fall out or anything like that. Um, when you start to apply it, it's like this really nice finish. And it 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 turns into like a powder, like a powder. It's not a powder, but it turns into like a powder, and it's whipped. It's so wonderful to use. Like when you put it on, it really doesn't feel like you have any makeup on. It's so light. A little bit goes a long way. I'm sorry, I'm looking at my sister. Uh, a little bit goes a long way and I love using it. It like gets all the areas. I don't have to mix it, which is the best thing. Like I really don't have to mix it because it fits me so perfectly when it comes down to putting it on. And I use this brush by Eco Tools. It's a flat head foundation brush, which I got from um, Walmart. Walmart. You get it from Walgreens, CVS, whatever. And it gets everything. It gets like under your eyes, under here, in between, up in here. And I love, like, it's, this is a perfect brush for applying the matte mousse. Like, some people use, like, this circular foundation brush it, uh, it's a circular flathead I don't know it looks weird but and they like put put it on but I find that a flathead brush works best for putting this on like and this brush is from Eco Tools. it's pretty cheap and you know anybody can get it I mean you don't have to buy one from Eco Tools, but as long as you get like a flathead brush to put it on it's wonderful um the best part about it is like I've had the this is a dream I moves for almost like two months and my skin doesn't get like super oily only I it probably doesn't get super oily because I do use like a BB cream that my sister turned me on to um, I use the CoverGirl BB cream medium to dark skin and I put it on over under the foundation and you really don't have to put too much under the foundation like concealer or anything you really don't have to put too much of that on because it like blends so well and covers everything when I say everything it covers everything 
um, but I use that. I love it. The only thing about it is like, I do have to carry like oil pads around because my skin's oily. It, it's always been oily, but I do carry oil pads around to like dab my face. And you don't have to touch it up. Like some of your makeup, you have to like touch up quite a bit. Like the, not to try to knock it, but cover girl, you tend to have to touch up a bit. Um, I really love it. I recommend it. Like the only thing is like if you have dry skin, it's not a product for you because it'll like show your dry skin. And like I, sometimes I'm really dry like up in here and I peel because it's winter time. Um, <laughs> so sometimes I have to like put a little bit more moisturizer on at the top on most days. Well, not most days, but some days. But I really do like that, and I really do recommend it. You can get it from CVS, Walmart, Walgreens. Um, Joel Osco sells them. I mean, I get mine from Joel Osco or Walgreens, because Walmart doesn't carry, like, Walmart doesn't carry all the colors, nor does Target. Like, they stop, I think, like, Walmart stops at, like, tan, dark three, and the Target near me stops at tan, dark one, or something like that. So... That's the only thing you kind of got to hunt it down if you want like a darker, darker color for your skin. Um, another product that I love using, which I have like two of these, is this Maybelline Nude Shell Lipstick, which is lovely. It's lovely. It's like the perfect amount of color for a person that doesn't like wear lipstick and I don't wear lipstick a lot I really don't I'm not a big lipstick person and it's the nude shell number 200 the only thing about it is like this is so hard to find in stores I don't even think they sell this shade anymore and the reason I use it is another youtuber um high on mac or iris she recommend recommended using this and she loved it, so I thought, you know, I'd try it. She does um, makeup videos, too. So I thought, you know, I'd give it a try since I'm not a big um, lipstick person. Um, it's wonderful. I got mine actually off of eBay. <laughs> eBay for, like, six bucks. And normally, like, Maybelline lipstick is, like, seven dollars in the store. I got it for six bucks, free shipping and handling. Um, and it comes in like within two days of you purchasing it, which was wonderful because, you know, sometimes things on eBay take forever. And it's brand new, unused, never, you know, not open, sealed, still sealed, so you don't have to really worry if you want to try it. Um, it's wonderful. I love it. Smooth finish, last you know, all day, really don't have to do too much about it. It's, it's wonderful, especially if you don't like a lot of, uh like a lot of makeup another product I love using is the Burt's Bees wax lip shimmer tinted lip shimmer and it, this is a um, peony this is the shade this is wonderful because I use this just about every single day just about every single day especially if I want some moisture on my lips or my lips are kind of dry and it's it's tinted so using that is wonderful I only use lip balms mostly. I, I love it. It's it's wonderful. Um, that's just about it. Like I've just like started experimenting with blush. I'm kind of like this coral blush blush fan. I just bought like something that was like peachy the other day. I'm gonna see how well that works out. And that's just about it. So I do recommend, you know, everybody try the Dream Matte Mousse, especially if you don't have, like, a lot of money. It's only, like, $10, you know. It's $10. Like, I don't have Mac money <laughs> currently at the moment. <laughs> but, like, if you're looking for, like, a great drugstore product, I recommend the Maybelline Dream Matte Mousse. But they also have, like, other mousse products, like the Air Mousse and the Dream whipped mousse or some type of mousse it comes in like a regular compact like how a regular um foundation comes in a regular the smooth mousse smooth mousse finish <laughs> the like a regular compact and i haven't tried that yet but and the colors um all stay the same actually but when you do oh, when you do go 
get this do try to get a shade darker because it dries the shade light so I'm caramel dark too but in the meantime I wish everybody a good uh, week um, next video will be probably Tuesday or Wednesday which will be way in way in number three most likely Tuesday because I have clinical on Wednesdays. So wait in number three will be Tuesday. And in the meantime, comment, rate, subscribe, do whatever, ask questions. I could care less. Uh, well, I do care, but because I'll answer them if you do. Um, that's just about it. So bye, everybody.